The advantages and disadvantages of manual testing and automated testing are a topic of debate in the software development industry. Which is better? Is manual testing sufficient for most companies? Or is a combination of both automated testing and manual testing beneficial and worth the cost? Let's explore these questions further. Manual testing typically involves the use of test cases to guide a software tester through a step-by-step -step testing process. By following steps such as manually clicking links, inputting values into fields, and verifying output, a tester can thoroughly test the functionality of a piece of software. By comparing actual outcomes with the expected result of a test case, the tester is able to detect bugs and defects in the software. A major pro of manual testing is that it's always necessary. If your company is continually developing and modifying software, manual testing is always going to be an essential part of the software development life cycle. Automation will work best for areas that do not undergo much alteration. Another pro is human judgment and intuition. A tester can use his or her knowledge and experience to judge whether or not the software is functioning as expected and find real user issues. An automated script may pass over and miss something that a tester would notice during manual testing. Manual testing is more immediate and convenient. With manual testing, you are able to test new ideas or functionality quickly and easily without the time and effort involved in setting up a test script. Finally, the cost is lower when using just a manual testing resource. An automated tool is often very expensive, and more so when you're employing a tester to create the scripts and maintain the tool. A con of manual testing is that it's time consuming. It takes longer for a tester to manually execute dozens of test cases. A correctly defined and set up automated tool might perform the same actions in only a matter of minutes. Manual testing can also be inconsistent, as the tester rarely performs the exact same process each time they run a test case. Automated testing is a method where the testing process is performed by an automated tool. These tools perform predefined actions that are defined by a script and then determine whether the actual results meet the expected results. The major pro of automation is that it's fast. An automated tool can execute a test or test suite at a much greater speed and frequency than a manual tester could possibly perform, thus reducing the time for testing. Regression testing can be executed quickly with an automated tool, leaving more time for functional and exploratory testing. Additionally, another pro is the potential for more thorough test coverage. An automated tool can be useful for testing with different configurations or platforms, as well as more possible inputs for data-driven testing. Another major pro of automated testing is that automation is precise and human error is lessened or eliminated. Automated tools do not become bored or miss something in a particular test run and instead will execute tests the exact same way each time. Finally, automated testing can free up resources for other projects. A major con to automated testing is that automated tools are quite expensive. Individual licenses can cost thousands of dollars, which is often a huge barrier for companies that want to save money. Also, automation only works for stable areas of the application. For software that is continually changing, automation is a futile effort because the scripts would have to be updated each time as well. Time must be taken to define which parts of the environment can be automated. Another con is that automation requires a higher skill level for the tester. To effectively write good test scripts, the software tester should be properly trained in the tool and proficient in a programming language that the tool uses. Finally, test automation can provide a false sense of security. For example, tests may pass when they should fail. If a requirement or the code has changed and the script isn't modified to account for this change, then the automated tool may miss something that would constitute a failure. One fact should be clear. Automated testing can never fully replace manual testing. It can only be a supplement. There will always be a need for manual testing, and this is especially true if software is constantly developed or modified. Uniting the two may be optimal for certain projects by canceling out the other's cons and promoting efficiency, flexibility, functionality, and quality. By using an automated tool to quickly execute a well-covered test suite for a relatively stable part of the software, a greater amount of efficient software testing can be accomplished. This increases the quality of the software and limits the risks in releasing the software.
Is automation worth the cost? To answer this, you need to define your goals. If you want to decrease the time it takes for regression testing, then automated testing could be very beneficial. Keep in mind that you'll probably have to hire an automation specialist or pull one or more of your testers away from manual testing for a while to set up the tool. Can you afford to take a tester away from manual testing or hire a new tester and provide the high upfront cost of automation? Or would it be less expensive to hire additional manual testers so that you can reduce the time of regression testing. Another cost consideration is that most automation testers are learning the software as they go along, taking a large amount of time and effort, which can basically result in a record and playback shop. Programming is essential to proper automation, so another question you might ask is, what languages do my testers know? Some automated tools have built-in languages, while other automated tools accept widely used languages like Java and C. What types of tests do you want to automate? If you want to automate web applications, there are open source tools that can be used free of charge, but have certain drawbacks, like the lack of tech support and the inability to automate client-server applications. Do you plan on integrating with other tools, like build, release, and test management tools? If so, your company may want to opt for a more expensive tool that provides multiple integration features. Automation is worth the cost if the automated tool provides a return on investment. If your analysis of the tool, your goals, and the cost needed for automating a suite can save you money, reduce the time to market, or catch bugs sooner in the SDLC, then automation could be worth the cost.